So just yesterday, I had an opportunity to listen to a leadership podcast that I really enjoy. And the host on it was talking about the fact that right now, we as leaders are hoping for certainty. And this is a time when certainty just doesn't exist. Short supply, like no supply. Harder to find certainty than toilet paper, if we're honest. But there's something almost as good as certainty. And that thing is clarity. Clarity. Now, I realize one of the things that has been kind of paralyzing me is that there's no certainty. Think about certainty like a map. Like if you have a map, you can see where you are and you can see where you're going and you can figure out how you get there. But there is no map for this year. We talked about that last time. Where we're going is nothing like what's behind us. Kind of like the Lewis and Clark expedition. And they didn't have a map. They had no way of knowing what, how to get from where they started to the Pacific Ocean. But they did have something that gave them clarity about where to go. They had, had a compass. Not this compass specifically. That would be kind of cool if I had that. But they had a compass. And compasses work because this little red arrow, if you're not around metal, is always going to point north. And if you're pointed north, you can then say, well, I want to head west. And you go 90 degrees counterclockwise. And you just keep following that red arrow until you get to wherever it is you're going. So... If we're gonna, if, if you would venture with me into the forest of metaphor for a second, a map is certainty, but we have clarity. And clarity, I think, came from the family survey. Thank you for everybody who filled that out because one of the things that came through loud and clear is that as parents, you're wondering about how your children are gonna be connected to other people, other adults this year. And you're also worried about safety, which makes total sense. So as I think about what is true north for our youth ministry, well, we already, we've already established that. It's love God, love others, love life. But what's our heading? What's our bearing? What's, what direction are we headed in? What is our west? As I look at the responses from the parent survey, it's safety and connection. So it's not maybe the best theme we've ever come up with, but a theme for this year is safely connected. And that means that we are gonna do everything we can to connect youth to each other to adults and to God in a way that's safe and helps people be comfortable with whatever we're doing. And because we had that great response, that and kind of an overwhelming response that, that you are excited about seeing youth meet in person, we've worked with DCPC staff and the church's medical advisory team and last night with the faith formation team to figure out, can we do this? And the answer is yes, we're going to do in-person small groups as well as virtual small groups this fall. And I'm excited to do that. Now it's necessarily gonna to have to be a little bit different than how we've done things. And if you keep reading this email, if you go down, there's gonna be something called Safely Connected. And it's gonna give you some ideas of, and this is kind of just the initial ideas of how this is going to look differently, but how we are hoping to do it. But the big thing is we're gonna communicate really clearly about what expectations are and what precautions are gonna be in place. We're gonna communicate really clearly about other options. Anything we do is gonna have multiple entry points, whether that's with a bigger group and by big, like 10 people, uh, a smaller group or a way to do it on your own or virtually. Everything's gonna have a virtual option because we don't think that to be part of our community, to be connected to us, that you have to be here at a certain time or a certain place. So we're gonna do everything we can to make that possible. So. I encourage you to read that. I encourage you to hit reply and send me questions and comments. There is a million things I know I didn't think about and I'm gonna need your help to think of them. Uh, Sunday, we're gonna have a parent chat virtually and in the afternoon and then later in the evening in person. So look below, those details will be there too. If you're reading this in the email, if not, go to dcpcyouth.org and we'll have some details there. But our goal is to be safely connected and we have some great ideas about how to do that, how to make the most of this year. And we're not going to have certainty, but I think the clarity is going to be the next best thing. Safely connected as our way this year to love God, love others, and love life. Thanks for watching, and we will see you soon.